What up? A little Friday night update. Um, all the parts haven't come in yet, but uh, I figured I'd start pulling stuff apart. Um, cars that are this old, this is a 2002 bug I'm working on, tend to have a lot of rust. Let me turn this Kodak black down real quick. <laughs> As I was saying, uh, this is an O2. I expected it to have a lot of rust, and even if it doesn't have a lot of rust, the bolts tend to uh, bind together to the metals that they're going through over time. Um, they can be a bitch to get out, so I figured I'd uh, spray them with PB Blaster and start trying to get them off early. Um, I was pleasantly surprised uh, when I started working on it. Pretty much every bolt came out way easier than they normally do. Um, I didn't snap any bolts. Uh, I didn't, I almost rounded off a housing, but I just knocked the socket on a little tighter because it wasn't fully on there and then it was no problem. Um, so I'm gonna turn the camera around and I'll show you what I've gotten done so far. So I took that out. I already had the cat back off because I fitted up a, a crappy eBay cat back and it was shit so i sent it back and then bought a gretty um i bought the gretty from um god what's his name grant anderson if you ever watched tommy f yeah and you've watched an episode with grant in it that's who i bought the gretty from so i bought a gretty ti cat back so the cat uh the axle back was already off and then i took this whole uh down pipe mid pipe off in one go um it's just easier that way um, I unplugged the O2 sensor so I didn't have to deal with screwing it out before I took the whole exhaust out. It's a pain in the ass. I might just buy a new O2 sensor too because those are pretty jammed in there most of the time as well. Um, so, let's get under here for a second. Thank God for LED lights, huh? Um, so yeah, down pipes off. I'm gonna start working on the up pipe bolts now. Supposedly this is gonna be a bitch. Um, everything else has gone kind of easily, so I'm expecting this to go the same. I already took the heat shield off the uh, header area, and I took started taking some of the bolts off, so those should come out okay. Um, so I think I'm gonna get the up pipe installed tonight, and then the rest of the stuff I'm just gonna wait until my, uh, actually, I can do the full up pipe and then I can snug up the down pipe I have and I won't fully tighten the down pipe. And then once the cap back gets here, I can uh, wrap that up. So <clears throat> that's all for underneath there. And then up top, I took the stock intake and stuff out cause I got this uh, DC one that I uh, use the heat reflective tape on, so I'll put that in there. Um, and then uh, I'll do the valve cover gaskets. Look how bad that fucking leak was. Do you see how caked that oil was? I feel like this is probably on the stock valve cover gaskets or maybe the second set the cars ever had. It's had it has 190,000 miles, but look at how fucking caked on that is. That is ridiculous. So I already have the gaskets. Um, I don't think I'm gonna do it tonight because I don't have any RTV um, to put in those specified areas uh, that Subaru recommends. So I'll probably do that tomorrow or Sunday or sometime next week. Um, due to the storms and all the places my shit is shipping from, um, I'm not gonna get my exhaust done till like mid next week because I won't have the parts. So I'm kind of just getting as much out as I can and putting on what I have. Um, and then I'm just gonna go for the, from there. My STI seats are coming from Florida. They'll be here Wednesday or Thursday. Um, it's a direct delivery signature and I probably won't be home. So I'll probably be, have to wait another day for that and go pick it up at the FedEx office. Direct signature is fucking stupid because no one's ever home. <laughs> but, oh well. Um, so yeah, that's just the update I have right now. I'm gonna keep cracking on it. It's like 9.30 right now, so 
still have a good amount of time. Keep the Kodak going. Um, so yeah, I'll, uh, I might update you guys when I get the up pipe in. Maybe not. It's not that exciting. Um, so I'm going to keep plugging away on this and I'll make another update in a few days whenever I get another big change going. All right. Thanks guys.